Here's a Rizlion coaster hub that has a B on it. It's R E S I L I O N. I'm not sure if I pronounce it. And across the spacer washers and the axle here, I have about 115, 114 and a half millimeters. It's got a coaster brake here. This 40 sprocket uh, holes here for the uh, spokes. This particular one I took apart to understand how it works because I've got one on another bike that has an A on it. and I'm not sure if the parts interchange. This has got a set of rollers that grabs the inside for the coaster and on the small bike I have the it's a part that's broken inside that slams it in. So I was going to try to swap some parts out. This has got a left hand screw that comes out nut these are the washers that space it from the frame that's the greasing hole I'm not sure on the web what this B means that's why I'm posting this vis vis uh, video here because this has got a B on it and the one I have on my bike has an A and this may be for a bigger bike, A and a B. R E S I L I O N. This is made in the UK, I believe. Here's a Rizlion hub on a single speed 20 inch boys bike from the early 60s. Over here it has an a on the hub. It's got a grease fitting here. This has got 40 spokes and the tire size on this is 20 by 1 and 3 8 17.75 diameter which is uh, 451 millimeters. It says Dunlop over here made in England. The particular tires are on here are 20 by 1 and 3 8 Sears linear tread from the dark ages. I want to say these are from this in plate 50 to 60 pounds. These tires are from 19 uh, about 70. Spacing on this hub is 119 millimeters between the uh, dropouts with the caliper 119 millimeters. This particular bike has 18 sprockets on the single speed and then over here on the driven it's got 32. The input side on the crank is 32. We got 18 here on the single speed. Reflector's not original nor is this pokey thing because this is broken. This particular hub there's an internal part broken. If you pedal backwards you can get it to stop. Taking this apart there's some uh, rollers in there then there's a piece that's physically broken in there. So if you pedal along, you have to keep on pedaling or it'll catch up with you. I need to go ahead and replace the balls in there. Torn. Made in England. And there's Hercules. It's got this distinctive frame that looks like this. It's got the little guaranteed sticker on here. Hawthorne, made by Hercules, and it 
didn't originally have a banana seat or high handlebars, so those are added later. It's got cottered cranks. The pedals say Brampton, England. This one's okay. This one, the balls came out. I gotta remove the dust cover, put new balls in there. I believe that's a Raleigh symbol, I'm not sure there, but this has got cottage cranks on it. The bottom bracket is just like Raleigh because Raleigh bought Hercules in that era. This has got the same uh, gizmo that grabs that to undo this to tighten up the bottom bracket. Frame size in this particular bike is very small. It's only a 15 inch frame bottom of the tube here. The number I could find on the frame is 12476 VA underneath the seat post. It's the only number I could find there except for the M that was on the bottom of the bottom bracket. Maybe with further cleanup I'll find some other numbers. This originally had fenders on it, so that's why there's the screw here and over here that was a place for a front fender to hook on. This says Brampton made in England for the front hub.